All right, hello everyone. So in this video, I just want to share this free plugin um, with everyone in the Philippines who wants um, a Gcash in Maya uh, WooCommerce checkout, a QR code checkout. Um, so I made this plugin because I renew. I had to renew my license, uh, my driver's license this year, and I guess here in the Philippines they're a little short on the actual IDs. So they gave me a piece of paper, which is a temporary license, and uh, apparently the merchant uh, services. Um, are not accepting that as uh, ID. So I, I'm, I'm just not able to set up a, a merchant account. So um, I got a little creative here and decided to make this. Um, so I made it for one of my sites and you know you can feel free to use it for yours. So to download the, uh, the plugin, just go to this site that I have set up, aifusiondev.com. I'll include a link in the description. Go to downloads. And you can go ahead and find that Philippine e-wallet WooCommerce payment plugin. Okay, so you can download it. You have to be logged in, um, so you can set up, a, you know, a free account and log in, and then you can go ahead and download that. So installing it is pretty easy, just like you install any other plugin. You know, you download the plugin um, and then install it, and then you go to the settings. So uh, let me show you the settings here for for this site. Um, you got the payments. Um, and then you go to here the Gcash and Maya. Okay, so here it is. So you just got to choose the file, find your QR code, and it's going. You upload that, and it's going to use that uh, for your QR code um, checkout. Okay. So let me show you what it looks like on an actual site. Here, real quick. So you got the checkout. You can choose between Gcash, okay, Maya, and then. I got Stripe set up here for this, okay? So how it works is instructions are right here. They need to send the payment first for the exact amount. So whatever this exact amount is, 2,549 and three cents. Um, they send it, they put the transaction number in here and then the, the, the cell phone number that, the, that it was sent from, okay? And then submit or you place the order. That way you can manually verify um, so it's a manual thing, by the way. So you're going to have to look at the transaction number, reference number, and the sender's number, cross-check it with your Gcash account or your Maya account, look for that transaction, you know, verify it, and then you can complete the order. So there you have it. That's the free plugin. Once again, you can check it out at aifusiondev.com. Thanks for watching.